the installer drills a hole that is large enough to accommodate the desired jack chain size. For a number 16 jack chain, this would be approximately 3 eighths of an inch in diameter. Jack chain may be acquired from most hardware stores. The jack chain is then lowered to floor level inside the wall cavity with a pull line or cable attached. A small bend in the cable may be applied to suspend the jack chain. The installer should always leave an adequate loop in the cable to accommodate the wall height. Multiple wall drops may be made prior to leaving the attic. The installer will now use the retriever unit to locate the jack chain suspended in the wall. Slowly move the retriever unit left to right at the outlet location, listening for the chain to make contact with the sheetrock. The jack chain will be magnetically pulled against the sheetrock when the retriever unit passes over it. This connection verifies the correct wall cavity as well as the chain location. When the installer is satisfied with the outlet location, a hole is drilled to retrieve the jack chain. When the hole is complete, the installer guides the retriever unit to the hole and retrieves the jack chain. The installer may also position the chain over a small hole and retrieve it with a hook or needle nose pliers. Jack chain may also be retrieved from the bottom of the wall cavity. This technique does not work well in metal stud construction.